hi guys thank you for joining me today this is Danny with Danielle's essentials and today we are unboxing the allure box so you won't be seeing me today because I am NOT sporting any kind of makeup and I look like a hot mess I'm starting to come down with the cold also um this box came in la last week but with the holidays and all the hours I was putting in, I had not had the opportunity to unbox it and video it. So here we are today to do it. Um, my other boxes are not going to be here. One should be here tomorrow, I believe, Birch box. But my Ipsy won't be here until the first of the year. So, um, and then my other boxes, I just didn't pay them. It was my fault, so they aren't coming in. My um, Boxy Charm and my Sephora. So let's go ahead and start with unboxing this one today. If I can do it one handed. So in here it says Leave Town for the Weekends Pack 10 Lipsticks. Why pack 10 lipsticks? Take 20. I know I always have a bunch of my desk at work. So. This is what the booklet looks like today, or this month, not today. Um, Jacqueline Hill on the cover. She's just absolutely gorgeous. Talks about what's inside of it. This is a $20 gift um, for a purchase off of Babu Bar. No clue what that is. I'll definitely have to look it up. And then let's open this. Let's see if I can get these papers to stay open so I see a lot of brands I know right off the top and my bubble wrap is empty so let's throw that away um I took it out of the package it came in but I have not opened it so everything in here is a complete surprise for me right off the bat I am seeing Becca and that's probably what was supposed to be in that bubble wrap so let's hope it's not broken that is a cute little sample Let's see, this is in Champagne Pop. Let's open this up. It is not broken, so perfect. So that's what it looks like. It does have a cute little mirror, and you're going to see my camera. And I'm going to put that there for now. We'll, well, I'll swatch it now. I was going to say I'll swatch it later, but let me go ahead and try to swatch that now. There we go. And that's what it looks like. Gorgeous, gorgeous color. And you definitely don't need a lot um, for it to show up. So there you can, if I can hold it right, there you can see my finger swatch. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous highlighter there. The next thing we have that I see peeking out from under other things is this Hourglass Veil Mineral Primer. So let's go ahead and open this up. It kind of looked like the packaging that the sample foundation stick came in. I was about to get excited because I loved that foundation. So this is what it looks like. It's actually glass and I don't know. There we go. I had to use my teeth. So of course I bit it, bit the lid. I'm trying to open this up so we can see what the dipper looks like. Oh, it's like a little spatula. And I'm not going to try to swatch that. Here, I'll just put it on my pinky. So, give me one second. I'm trying to screw the lid back on. So that's what it looks like. Really light, it doesn't feel like much at all. I like that. I'm definitely gonna have to give that a try tomorrow. And then we have Orbe Matte Waves Texture Lotion. Always, always love to try this stuff out. Again, I'm using my teeth to pull it open. Oh, it smells really good too, it smells real clean. And that can see. There we go. I don't want to. I had the lid in my mouth, so there we go. Um, I 
Sorry about that. I had the lid in my mouth trying to screw it back on. The next thing we have is some Dior Mascara Professional Volume. Um, I'm not going to open it because I have a lot of mascaras already open and I don't want it to dry out or go bad. But if that's what the wand looks like on the inside, I think I'm going to like it. It's completely different than my Chanel, but um, I'll definitely give it a try. Oh, there we go. New patent anti-drying airlock system. I don't want to try it. I don't want to test it out, so I don't want to open it. But that looks pretty interesting. I can't wait to finish up my other mascara so I can give it a try. And then we have the Purity Philosophy. What is this? Oh, hello. 3-in-1 cleaner for your face and eyes. So let's me pop the lid on this one. I think there's there's definitely a seal on that one so I'm not gonna try to unscrew it I tried squeezing it and nothing was coming up so that tells me there's a seal which that's fine I like seals and oh I do not have a Morphe brush as of yet and it appears that Allure has included one in this box Oh, I'm excited. So give me one second because it appears I will need to tear this with my teeth. There we go. Now if I can figure out how to get it out. And let's see if I can do things right the right way. Take that from being upside down and best still upside down. So, if this is the Morphe, dang, I need my glasses, M422 or 33. Let's see if you guys can make that out. That looks like a 33 to me. That's what it looks like. It has a cover on it. Let's see if I can get that off. There we go. That's what it looks like. It looks like a really nice blend, blending brush. It's kind of, I wouldn't say stiff, but a little firmer. It feels really soft, just a tad bit firmness on it. Um, I don't know if you can see. I don't think you're going to be able to see it. See how some are sticking out? I'm sure once I wash them and push them back together, it'll be fine. But I can't wait to give this a try. I'll definitely give it a try tomorrow um, when I get ready for work in the morning. So, that is what our Allure box looked like this month. If you don't know what Allure is, Allure is a monthly beauty subscription. And it does come with, um, as you can tell, uh, sample size stuff. Um, you could get a full size item like you just saw there. I got the full size Morphe makeup brush. Um, it is, I'm going to say $12. To $13 a month um, I did go to cancel a few months ago and they offered me $10 a month for the next three months so December was my last month at $10 but at this point I don't think I'm gonna be canceling it I have been really impressed with them the three months that I got the cheaper rate so it's definitely worth it I'm loving the products that they're sending they're sending some nice high-end products um, as we can see today, we got the Becca, the Dior, and the Hourglass. And not only that, we got a makeup brush. So, I'm excited. I'll be keeping them. And hopefully, all the other boxes will come in as soon as we can get the mail flowing with, uh, with all those packages that were going out for Christmas. So, I didn't upload a video all last week because I was waiting on makeup boxes. And then this one came... And then I was kind of waiting for more and then I checked and they aren't coming until um, one this week and then one next week. So I didn't wish all of my followers a Merry Christmas. So Merry Christmas and I'm sorry it's about two days late. It is today's Tuesday, right? No, today's Wednesday. Jeez Louise. Today is Wednesday 
and I will hopefully be uploading another video later this week when the birch box comes in and then I am going to be uploading a video again uh, later this week as well this box that I'm that's under this box down there not this one the brown box that I'm have everything on top of that is a Tupperware shipment I received today with some gorgeous products that were included in a sale that just ended and I wanted to show them off they are so beautiful and there is a possibility I might be able to pick up another set or two if anybody's interested in purchasing one so make sure that you subscribe to my channel and like this video and hit your notification bell so that you can get notified when I do upload that video on that Tupperware so uh, if you do follow me on social media on Facebook or on Instagram check out Danielle's Essentials and I'll be posting some pictures of the Tupperware products here as soon as I'm done doing my video for you guys today thank you for joining me and you have a great evening bye